So, uh, again, uh, hello everyone. Uh, we are a young team of 24 employees. We're located at Tel Aviv and Moscow. And what we're doing is we're developing an AR communication platform. Uh, we bring together uh, traditional communication features as well as a unique layer of augmented reality. Now, how do we do that? We do that uh, based on a family of 3D animated characters that pretty much help every user to uh, enhance his emotions and deliver them digitally. Let's start going over on the product. So we'll start with the augmented reality layer. We have four different augmented reality editors, and each one has a different purpose. So the first one is the augmented reality editor, the one on the left. This feature we have announced yesterday here at the conference, we pretty much released it yesterday to both stores. And this is the first time in communication that a person can actually create a complex air scene with videos, images, he can direct a digital uh, animated character, and to deliver his full emotions, and the big thing here is that the receiver will not get a video. It will get the full augmented reality experience at its own location. The second thing we have announced yesterday also, but we haven't released it yet, we'll release it within a couple of weeks, is location-based AR editor. So think about it this way. Uh, we pretty much go in over living our lives and we uh, we have a lot of experience coming in and a lot of different things we'd like to share with friends. But in, in different cases, the location is super important. For example, if I'm right now at the beach and I'm seeing like a beautiful sunset and I want to deliver this, uh, this experience to my wife, tell her that uh, I love her and this is a romantic experience, so what can I, I can do? I can pretty much create an air scene at the beach, send it to my wife. She will have to come to the beach to that exact location where she can open the entire air scene and she can get it admired by the view. Uh, the next editor we have, this is a video editor. So this is something the video editor and the image editors, both of them are pretty much, you can capture an uh, image or record a video, then you can use the family of, uh, our family of uh, 3D animated characters to put them on top just to deliver more emotion, and you can create a, a cool clip out of it and just share it with your friends. The second layer, or the basis for everything here, this is the traditional communication, as we like to call it. So in this layer, we have, of course, the 3D animated characters. Now, they're not as simple as you guys might think. First of all, everything is animated, everything is moving. And if you want to deliver even more emotions, and you think that the language that we have created is not uh, 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 as good as you would like, and you want to deliver some more information, so first of all, you can add uh, audio to that, as you can see the play button, so I can record audio and add it to the sticker. Or I can also add text. So at the end of the day, I can deliver pretty much everything I want with this new language. Uh, another feature that we have created is a prediction uh, feature. What it means is, every time someone will send you a 3D animated character and you all of a sudden don't know what to do, you can click it and you will get specific recommendations just for you based on your behavior, what you should respond with. Another feature that we have, and to be honest with you, people actually love, is the live typing. The live typing is pretty simple. I can start typing a mesh. The other user will see it in the black box, as you can see it over there, and he can start responding immediately. So the, the conversation gets much faster, much more interesting, much more alive. And on Android, for example, it gets even more vivid because we even send live push notification. What does it mean? If someone starts typing me and I own an Android device, I will get a push notification. The push notification will be empty. And then in real time, outside of the application, I, I get to see what the text is all about. So if I'm interested in that, I can just click go online and inside the application and communicate with that person online. Uh, the last feature is a personal profile with likes and comments, which it's about to get much more interesting when we're going to add augmented reality to that. Uh, actually, I haven't, I haven't mentioned it, but there's a lot of IP around it, a lot of patents we have applied to around this entire technology. So let's see, I hope it will work, the video. Let's see a quick video about the AR editor. No, it doesn't work. No.
Okay, guys, sorry, we left. We don't have uh, more time. So if you guys are interested in our marketing strategy, all of the financials and the money we already raised, you can look for the snappy t-shirt and come talk to us. Thank you so much. Thank you.